to another late night vlog at West London Wine School. And um, today, um, rather tonight, we are looking at just one wine in a, in a very short post, but uh, well worth it. This wine deserves its own single post. We're looking at a white Bordeaux. Yep, you heard it right, white Bordeaux. 90% of Bordeaux is red. Um, a very, very large number. 2% sweet wine and that little 8% is either white or rosé or clarette. Um, so not a big proportion of wine coming out of Bordeaux is white. However, it's up and coming and it's really good. Most of the white comes from the entre de mer district in between the two major rivers, um, but there's some really interesting things coming from Bly in the north um, and some of it from the left bank as well, especially around Pessac Clairon where the real oaky, really intense tropical fruit styles are, are coming out. Excellent wines. However, this one's even more different. This is a Chateau Gelli Sec from Bordeaux. It just says Appalachian Bordeaux. It means it could be from anywhere, but this property is actually on the road, on the D2 road, on the way to Margot. A wonderful property situated just before the likes of um, Montgravi uh, and also not far away really from the areas like Parma, Chateau Parma, Chateau Margot. Wonderful little property. Um, Sauvignon and Semillon blends. Sauvignon Blanc and Semillon. The classic blend here in Bordeaux. What this does really well, which stands it head and shoulders above others, is its ability to have such a premium quality smell. By that, if I smell this, wow, it's got lovely fruit. I mean, there is citrus there, green lime, an apple note, but then there's this lovely vegetally grassy note mingled in with mineral and absolutely bags and bags of this mineral. Smelling this, you would easily go, Pui Fume, or maybe Sancerre from the Loire Valley. It smells like a premium 15, 20 pound bottle of Loire Valley and it's Magnificent. Why is it this good? Well, yeah, most Sauvignons and most of the whites and the blends come from entre de mer. Clay limestone soil doesn't really have much character. It does to the wine, but it does. Um, it is a good growing condition for the white grape varieties. However, this is in that near Margot area. It's gravelly soils uh, with a bit of limestone. That gravelly adds that stony, flinty, not flinty, but small stony mineral touch. And there's loads of it here. And then on the palate. Mm. Mm. Ultra refreshing. Lovely zestiness. Lemon, lime. Apple gooseberry touch comes through. And then that lovely development into vegetal and mineral. And the length is minerally. It's a classically premium wine. Really good stuff. Um, only around 12% alcohol, so you don't feel that here at all. Lovely acidity, which is refreshing. Fantastic. Um, Bordeaux Blanc, Sauvignon Semillon from the left bank, from not far from Chateau Margaux in Margaux, the left bank. 2008. Serious kit. Give it a try. Weight shows, I think at just under £10, 9 or £10. Um, tastes like £15 to £20. Brilliantly worth it. Salut, have a good night. Ciao.